Hi everyone, it's great to be with you, focusing on the Kingdom of God and today I want to talk about another A, like the all the points I'm making are linked to the word, the letter A as a starting letter and uh, today I want to talk about how we how it can transform our life when we understand that the kingdom is apparent it's apparent it's 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 manifesting it's apparent to us that the kingdom is here and uh so that word apparent and so i want to i want to focus on um uh, if you go to your bibles luke 11 and i'm just using my phone to bring up uh, something on google um in iv version you know, Jesus was driving out a demon that was mute um, and the demon left and the man who had been mute spoke and the crowd was amazed. And then the people began to harass Jesus and say, you did that by the by um, Satan himself. And so it wasn't apparent to them that the kingdom had arrived. But for Jesus, it certainly was because, you know, Jesus had... Um, had uh, you know cast out that demon, and God gave him discernment to know that it was a mute spirit that was behind um, that condition of the man being mute. But interestingly, when Jesus is challenged, he says this in verse twenty. This is what I want to highlight to us: that if I drive out demons by the kingdom of God, um, sorry, if I drive out demons by the finger of God, by the finger of God, then the kingdom of God has come upon you. Right. So as far as Jesus was concerned, the fact that that person that was mute um, could be set free was a sign of the presence of the kingdom and the finger of God being at work. Why finger? I was thinking about it. Um, if you look at my painting, can you see some of those wavy lines? And the, it's actually a thick impasto oil painting. It's very textured. And that's where I've been holding the brush and working with my fingers tightly with the brush to really create a lot of texture in those wavy uh, parts of the foliage on the trees. And so see when you direct energy through your finger, it's focused and it's it can really accomplish a lot. And so there's something about God putting his finger on situations in our life where we invite his presence in and the, the kingdom authority is manifesting um, that, you know, we've got to be, it's got to be apparent to us that it's the kingdom of God, like it was for Jesus. It's so beneficial when we know that. And uh, when we have, when we see ministry, you know, um, and we minister ourselves and it's apparent to us that the kingdom is actually here uh, rather than, you know, being like um, the crowd who said, oh, that's by Satan. You know, Satan's actually helping him to cast out demons. Do you no, no, it's by the finger of God. And so um, uh, so I, I, I think we've got to start in the little, you know, with this. Um, I remember I, I prophesied to someone um, and, and released the gift of prophecy to them. I was in an indigenous community in Halls Creek. And uh, uh, this is just an example, you know, of the finger of God at work. Um, and I said to that person, you've received the gift. Why not prophesy now? And like, but really? Me? And they, they, I said, what do you see or sense? Just pray for a moment, close your eyes and focus on God. And they just heard something that and was distinct. It was just two words. And they just shared those two words uh, to a friend. And um, interestingly, when they did it, wow, they had goosebumps all over their arm, you know, their hair raised up. It was apparent to them that God had used them, that the kingdom of God was, uh, was, hap was, was there, uh, um, you know, and God, the king, was really moving through my friend as he prophesied. Never done that before. The power of God came upon him. So um, this is really important because... We can be so edified. He was so edified through that experience. Jesus must have been so edified through, you know, seeing the, the man that was mute being set free. And, you know, God wanted people to be amazed at the authority of Jesus, to be amazed at the king and to really look to God. Um, whereas some people didn't realize that the king, it was apparent that the kingdom had come 
and they harden their heart. So it's really important that we take that posture of recognizing when the kingdom is there and we're yielding to the king. All right, so let me just pray for us right now. Father, I pray that you'll give us discernment to know when it's your kingdom, Lord, that's apparent. Just like the magicians in the Old Testament who knew that the gnats were able, the gnats could not be created. And uh, um, Moses and Aaron, uh, you know, were, were moved upon by God and they said the finger of God is here because of that miracle. Give us that, Lord, ability to discern when your finger is at work so we can release your hand in our lives and we can see many blessings flowing. I just ask for that sensitivity in Jesus' name. Amen. God bless you.